According to a Rockstar Games insider, Tez2, the studio is aiming for a holiday 2024 release date for the GTA 6. As he said on GTA forums, their aimed always changing not set in stone deadline is holiday 2024, which has been pushed back multiple times the past few years. Unfortunately, it could slip into early 2025 as well. Speaking of which, most companies are returning with a forced return to office policy to revert back to pre-pandemic days. Activision Blizzard is already met with internal backlash. Rockstar is no different. The debate and consequences of the policy is a whole another topic. With almost the entirety of the workforce in office, Rockstar could be more firm about an announcement this year. Yet, losing work talent could very much lead to more delays. I personally see an announcement as a given this year. I don't think the upper management is in a position to delay further to holiday 2025-2026. Cutting more portions of the game to package into DLCs to release later on may be sustainable for management than delaying further. As you can see, Tez2 believes that an announcement about GTA 6 is likely to happen this year. And if that's the case, we could be getting more details about the game, its storyline, and its gameplay mechanics very soon. But there's another issue that we need to consider. GamesRadar's new interview with Rockstar North design director Scott Butchard and lead designer Chris Bell got some info about future plans for GTA Online. They said that the fans can expect many updates on the horizon in 2023, since the game has shown no signs of slowing down in its almost decade-long run. While the team has a vision for the game, they also want to incorporate player feedback into future content. GTA Online has been a significant source of revenue for Rockstar Games, but many fans are concerned that the GTA 6 single-player campaign will suffer as a result. We can all agree that the storyline and missions are what made the previous GTA games so enjoyable. After the release of GTA 5 in 2013, Rockstar Games announced plans to release story-based DLC for the game's single-player mode. The studio had previously released two single-player DLCs for GTA 4, The Lost and Damned, and The Ballad of Gay Tony. However, after the unexpected success of GTA Online, Rockstar Games changed their plans and focused on releasing additional content for the online mode instead of single-player GTA 5. Over the years, GTA Online has received significant updates and content, while the single-player story mode in GTA 5 has not received the same level of attention. This has led some players to feel that a similar situation could happen with GTA 6. So what can we expect from GTA 6? Will it live up to the hype? Will the single-player campaign be as immersive and engaging as we want it to be? There's no doubt that Rockstar Games has a lot of pressure to deliver with this game, but we also need to be patient. Creating a game of this scale takes time, and we don't want Rockstar Games to rush the development process and end up like Cyberpunk 2077 at launch. Even though we are already waiting almost 10 years for the next GTA, I think it's worth waiting a bit more so we can get the game in finished state. I'm sure the studio is aware of the backlash that CD Projekt Red received, and they will likely take steps to avoid a similar situation. In conclusion, while it's exciting to hear that GTA 6 might be released in 2024, we need to take this information with a grain of salt. We still don't have an official announcement from Rockstar Games, but it would be great if the trailer came out this year. What do you think about the release date of GTA 6? Are we already waiting too long and the game should be announced and released this year? Or should we give Rockstar Games more time to make sure that the game is fully ready? To not get disappointed like in the case of Cyberpunk 2077. Let me know in the comments. Also, I see that many of you still don't subscribe to my channel, so please hit the subscribe button. I'll really appreciate it. Thank you for being here today, and see you in the next one.